today we're going to go for a, um, a walk up to the uh, Byron Bay Lighthouse. Okay, here we are at the Byron Bay base. This is first um, caravan park, Byron Bay. Another very windy day. So I'm just going to cook up a bit of brekkie in the van and then we'll head off on our trek. A lot of the time I cook inside, I think there's enough ventilation through the window and the door open. Especially when I'm looking out over a nice little view like that. <laughs> World's best breaking. Okay, so we've both got a belly full of bricky. It's about an eight kilometer return walk. Um, so here we are, leaving on a full tank. A great way to start the day. It's actually a really nice walk. It, uh, it starts off relatively flat and then introduces a few slight sort of inclines and then gradually gets tougher as you go on. So I feel like with this trip, you really warm up to the walk. Yeah, nice little views through here. There's three young, fit people in front of us. They're our marker. They're not going to get away from us. In fact, I think me and my super wife here are going to overtake them before we get to the top and see the lighthouse. I think we're actually gaining on them. Look at that. They're not as fit as us. <laughs> yeah. This boardwalk's nice. They've done the whole track up. New boardwalks, new concrete paths, replacing the old dirt footpath and lots of little uh, nice um, new plastic decking. Here we go, we're gaining on these young people. They haven't got a chance. Here's a left turn off the pass, car park and cafe. And this is where we go into a um, little forest walk. There's down and up over the hill to Watergoes Beach. 1.7 k's that sign just said. And this is where the uh, black station ends. <laughs> a nice little walk through here. Still the hard bits yet to come. Just start seeing the blue ocean between the trees here. Now this GoPro shows how steep this hill is. Bit of a slide down in wet if you're not careful. Okay, this is the last easy bit of the calm before the storm. From here on in, you probably won't hear me talking much. That first bit of the climb, I'm already tired. Hopefully the engine will kick in soon. Magnificent view, tiring walk, but magnificent view.
nice little paved footpath on a gentle slope but the uh the challenging steps are just up ahead oh this will burn off the coffee and donuts i'll have later on <laughs> It's always good to stop and check out the surf and watch a few good rides. This is the famous Water Gaze Beach. Another nice little right hand wave. He's having fun. Enjoying this last little bit of flat land before the big hill. This is the part that was all just dirt and old timber stairs. We've done a good job with this. I still can't find the escalators anywhere. <laughs> but look at this, here we go. Ooh. Little Rest the chair to get your heart rate back to normal. Whew. A nice little 10 metre flat spot. Get the heart back under 200 beats. <laughs> Still a nice little rainforesty walk through here. Magic views and more stairs. Okay, here we go. Here we go now. There's a few little rest stops like this along the way. I think if I sit down, I probably won't get up again for a while. And this staircase to our left goes down to a little lookout that I won't bother today and here's a photo of that little lookout I just mentioned I took this later on and just added it in now just for your own uh, info I didn't count them there always seems to be about 50 odd stairs and then a little flat bit we can sort of have a bit of a mini rest Whew. and then someone jogs past you <laughs> I'm gonna have a crack at running these killer stairs <laughs> Sorry? Like you're making some oh I don't know <laughs> here we go Oh boy, a young bloke ran up these in front of me yesterday and I thought, am I too old? Oh, I'm not breaking any records. Jesus. Oh, oh. made it. Oh. Oh. I only just made that. Oh, I didn't count them, but I'm glad there wasn't any more stairs than what there was then, because I'm naked. I suppose I could, I could have been sensible and walked up them. Anyway. What's this camera was zoom in, but there's that little what I mentioned the stairs on the left before. That's the lookout that you would have walked to. 
If I'd done that, I don't think I would have energy to do this. Oh boy. There we go, that's one thing I forgot to mention. I'm now on the most eastern point of Australia, which is pretty cool. And there's the lighthouse, just over those trees there. Here we go, next to the stairs. These aren't, these ones aren't as hard as the first lot. Whew. Done. Little rest stop. And I think, is there another set of stairs? Or is this it? Getting awfully close to that lighthouse. Whew. I don't run much, I walk a lot, and I ride my pushy a lot. I'm actually surprised that I'm not as unfit as I thought I'd be. It's just me puffing, puffing and puffing through the camera. Whew. But yeah, she's a little bit of a challenge coming up to the lighthouse. It's actually blowing a gale up here. Nice view down to the bay. Whew. Gotta hang on to my hat. Because it blows off my head. I'm not sure if you can see how far down I am, but she's a, uh, a long climb down. Oh, wouldn't you know it? There's some more stairs up here to the actual lighthouse. I better take them on. Getting a real good glimpse of it here, not far to go. Okay, the final stair challenge. Here we go. Thanks again for watching everyone. If you like this video, please consider subscribing, liking and sharing with others. Any questions or feedback, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks again for watching and safe travels. Bye bye.